Hi there, I'm Cullen from CullensABCs.com and this story is sponsored by Storytime Felts. And the name of this story is Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Okay, let's put on our good looking eyes together, shall we? Okay, let's put them on. Okay, and your listening ears, let's put them on. Okay, are you ready? Because I may need some help in this story, okay. So, once upon a time, there were three bears. There was the daddy bear, he's the big bear. The mama bear is the medium sized bear. And the baby bear, which is the small bear. So let's do it together. Big, medium, small. And they lived in a beautiful house in the woods. And the daddy bear had a square, big square chair that he liked to sit in. And the mama bear had a medium sized comfy chair that she liked to sit in. And the tiny baby bear had a tiny chair that he liked to sit in. And then upstairs, can you see upstairs? That's where they sleep. The daddy bear had a big bear that big bed that he liked to sleep in and the mama bear had a medium sized bed that she liked to sleep in and the baby bear had a tiny bed that he liked to sleep in now the mama was making some porridge in the kitchen and it was hot and this is the daddy's bowl, the big bowl, and the mama's bowl is the medium bowl, and the baby's bowl is the small bowl. Now, I need your help. I have a question for you. What color is the daddy's bowl? It's yellow, you're right. And the mama's bowl, the medium-sized bowl, is green, and the baby's bowl is red. That's right. So the mama said the porridge was too hot to eat. So they went out the door for a little walk in the woods. And they left for a little while because they thought, well, let's let the porridge cool for a little while. And then when we come back, it'll be all ready to eat. So they left and went for a walk in the woods. And then a little girl named Goldilocks she was sad and she was lost in the woods. She lost her way from home. And so she came to the bear's house and she thought, oh, this is a beautiful house. I'm going to knock on the door and see if anybody's home. They could help me. Is anybody home? And there wasn't an answer at the door. So she thought, well, I'll just walk on in. I'm really tired and I, and I don't know where my home is. So I'm going to walk on in. And then she came to the chairs. She said, oh, this big chair looks good. I'm going to have a seat in this chair. And then she said, oh, I don't really like that chair. It's, it's too hard and it's too big. She said, well, I'm going to go to the medium-sized chair, the mama's chair. I'm going to sit in there. And she said, oh, that one's too soft. I don't like that one. And then she came to the baby's chair, the little chair, and she said, oh, I like that chair. That chair feels good, but she was so big in the chair that the chair broke. Oh, no. So then she thought, well, <clears throat> I'm going to go over to the kitchen. I'm going to go over to the kitchen, and I'm going to see, oh, look, I see what the mama bear made. <gasps> I am going to eat some of this porridge. So she got out her spoon, and she tried the big bowl first and she thought oh that is too hot I don't like that and then she went to the mama's bowl and she tried that one and that one was too cold she didn't like that one at all and then when she came to the baby bear's bowl she said mmm that is just right I love that one and she gobbled it all up and ate it all up and then her belly was feeling so full that she decided to go upstairs for a little nap and she went upstairs to the big Papa Bear's bed. And she tried the bed and she said, oh, no, that's too hard. I don't like this bed. 
I'm going to go to this bed. Oh, I love this bed. It's so pretty. Oh, I love it. And she laid down that bed, and oh, it was too soft. So she came across the room to the baby bear's bed. She lay down in the baby bear's bed, and it was just right. And she fell fast asleep. And then, guess who came home? The bears, right? The bear family. So the papa bear came in, and the medium-sized mama bear came in, and the teeny tiny baby bear came in. And they came in and they went, hmm. The papa bear said, well, it looks like somebody's been sitting in my chair. And the mama bear, the medium-sized bear, said, it looks like somebody's been sitting in my chair. And the baby bear, remember what happened to his chair? Came over and said, oh, my chair's broken. Somebody's been sitting in my bed. Uh-oh. And then they went into the kitchen. <clears throat> and they went over to the Papa Bear, went to his bowl. He said, oh, somebody's been eating my porridge. And the medium-sized Mama Bear went to her bowl and said, Somebody's been eating my porridge. And the baby bear went to his bowl and said, oh, Somebody's been eating my porridge and it's all gone. Oh no. So now what should they do? Go upstairs. So Papa Bear went upstairs. And he's thinking, well, I think there's probably somebody that's been in my house. So he went upstairs to look at his bed. And he was like, oh, somebody's been sleeping in my bed. And the medium-sized mama bear went to her bed and said, Somebody's been sleeping in my bed. And the baby bear went to his bed and said, Somebody's been sleeping in my bed and she's still there! Ah! And the little Goldilocks girl got out of bed and she screamed, Ah! And she ran, 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 ran all downstairs and out the door. And off she went far away, back to her home. And then the papa bear thought, well, oh, I hope she's okay, and went out the door to find her, but she was long gone. Thanks, Storytime Felts. Bye!